Yo, what it is, man? What's happening, ladies? You know what it is. Small little break, but we in here, though. Beautiful, beautiful Friday morning, man. July the, what's today? The 19th, 18th? July the 19th. I'm going to do the introduction because I'm a professional, but y'all, y'all know what time it is, man. You know what network it is, man. Rospo, the TV is indeed back on the way. Sports on is indeed back on air. AM. AM, man. Got story time. Got a fun story time for y'all, too. Dig this. You guys are going to learn the real reason today on this start of story time <clears throat> for the vault. This is actually a little personal story of mine involving uh, a major NBA finals with and this is an NBA player. I'm gonna I'm gonna pinpoint the day that my Draymond Green disdain began. Maybe I can give a better perspective on why I really cannot stand it for more often than not. Um I gotta provide some context, man. So I as y'all know, anybody who knows this person, you know how I put food on the table for myself since I was, you know, a preteen. So in this line of work, you know, at 14, 15 years old, bro, you got a, a lot more money than everybody else in your age bracket, for sure. So when you have, when you when you're living like this and you're in this line of work, sports gambling in the streets is an extremely popular thing to do. I wasn't much one that enjoyed shooting dice or anything like that. I don't really like gambling, playing games with people. That's another conversation with another day. But if there's a game on TV, the higher stakes that game is, the higher the price goes. Oh yeah, I was on it. I wanted. I wanted in. And this is me. So this is in 2016. Then this happened to me as like an 11th grader. I think it might, I don't know. I got to see. One of them years. You know what I mean? Um, The NBA Finals is on. The uh, This is a, a rematch, man. It's the Cavs and, and Warriors rematch. This is before I knew that they were going to play against each other in the NBA Finals four times on a freaking rope. Right? Um, and at this time, I'm at like peak. I'm a peak LeBron hater at this time, bro. Like, I don't want to give him credit for nothing. I want, I want him to receive credit for nothing. Like, I'm a peak level LeBron hater at this point in my life. You know what I'm saying? My team is long. The 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 ship must to be competitive in in New York City. That long sail, um. You know, they robbed my boys here in D.C. They robbed my boys in the second round. So I, I, all my regular interests, I, I just didn't have it. I put, and this is a lot, this is a, this is a bag, especially for a 15-year-old, though. I put about 450, 400, anywhere between 400 and 450. On the Warriors, taking the series home, I ain't bet how many games. I didn't bet. Money land and then like that. This organized betting hadn't came out yet. <laughs> I just strictly bet with me and my dog, you know, who was also in the same line of work that I was in, that the Warriors would win the chip. And I put I put about 400, 450 strong on that. I can't remember if it was 400, 450. I really can't remember. Strong on that. Mind you, this the whole stash, y'all. This the whole stash spot. Like I, had, I unloaded the whole stash like a fool. <laughs> Now I'm talking about I was a lizard. I'm I'm feeling good. When they up 3-1, I'm feeling good. You know, when the Cavs win game five, I'm still feeling good, bro. I don't feel discouraged per se. I'm still feeling good. Um bro, when they went to game seven, I did not feel good anymore. 
This is how they went to game seven. Let me tell you how they went to game seven. Remember I brought up Draymond kicking LeBron in his genitals? Remember I brought that up not too long ago? On, uh, I think, what I was covering, Skip, Skip versus Draymond? Well, that kick... Cost not only did he cost his team a championship, but I didn't know it yet. At that moment, he costed me my stash spot money. At that moment, he got because at, the, at that moment he cost his team championship. So he costed me my money at that moment. I just didn't know. When he did it, it happened so I ain't gonna say it happened so fast, but it looked so crazy, I did not think that that's what he did. You know, and at that time, nobody had ever taken an attempt like that at LeBron. So I'm like, nobody has ever tried no mess like that with that man until that day. You know, never. And even though I was wanting them to win, you know, obviously if LeBron got hurt or something like that, I would have benefited greatly from it. But I, I did not like it, and I knew – that the game was going to make him pay for that. I just didn't know how, you know. <clears throat> well, as y'all know, he gets suspended for two games. And I'm not really measuring his importance accurately at this at this time. Either. I'm like, oh, they'll, they'll be fine. <laughs> you know what I mean? He's just a rebounder and a defensive guy. Uh, they'll be fine. No, they won't be fine. They will not be fine. In fact... They're far from fine. They just met their demise. And you know it. You know what I mean? So it's like game seven comes. I mean, I'm sitting there. I watched every last second of game seven, bro. But the thing is, um, I, I low-key, in the back of my head, I knew something was wrong with this picture and that something unusual was going to happen. Like, I didn't want to say, oh, Cavs going to win, because then that means I'm going to lose money. I definitely didn't want that. But I knew something unusual was going to happen. A team going to game seven after being up 3-1, especially in my era, absolutely unheard of. Very, very unusual. Um, Very, very unusual. So game seven, yeah, he plays – one of the greatest Game 7s I've ever seen in my life, obviously. Um, if I haven't said that on record, there, there it is on record. One of the, easily one of the greatest Game 7s. Playoff history, period. You say NBA final, playoff history, whatever. Um, the playoff history, period, that is easily one of the most entertaining and, and um, explosive, just box office Game 7s. But nonetheless, it still resulted in me having to go back outside that summer and restart my pipe, my 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 counter. <laughs> so that's really where I the dislike for Draymond started, man. You cost me Maria money, bro. I don't appreciate that, man. I ain't betting on you or you guys no more. But in the future, could you keep your hands and feet to yourself? And don't get suspended no more in the finals. I'd appreciate that, brother. Happy Friday, y'all. We'll be back.